I think this is many bricks with the Lego Star Wars Darth Vader tie events, which is this build is considered a custom build. Uh, a lot of you people uh, recognize saying, that, hey, did you get that from the TIE Bomber? Yeah, I did ever since last year of 2023 when that set released. Um, I was watching videos on YouTube, the reviews and um, anything like that. And then I was watching one video that you can actually build Darth Vader TIE events. And I'm sitting there like, what? No way. And then a year later, in 2024, right now, that I was decided to want to pick it up just to want to check it out in person, build it, the actual tie bomber. And I'm sitting there like, okay, it looks pretty decent, even though I'm not too crazy about tie bombers like that. Like, eh, it's, a, it's whatever, it's just boring, but where it was on my mind. And then after all that, I decided to want to part out because something tells me in my head that I could build. Or Vader tie events is this one right here, and then I start parting out, build it, and then voila, which is I'm gonna show you guys right now due to the details, which is it looks really, really nice, like really, really nice on the front side, on the left side, and then the back side, and then um, on the right side too, and comes up with the stand, display stand. Whether you want to display in your room, office, Lego room, or whatever you want to put this thing at. And then here's a little uh, very closer look at the uh, stand. And now, here it is without it. And while I'm holding this, this thing is sturdy. That it won't wiggle or fall off or anything like that. It, and I'm like, oh wow, that's perfect. So that way it won't fall out. Like, really. And then here's the top part for the details of this ship. It looks really, really nice. And then other knees. Here's the cockpit. And this Technic build right here looks so amazing. That a lot of us people remember from the TIE Bomber. Just looks so cool. Like, really. Because it's a corner piece, since many of you people don't know the name of it, I will pop it up on the screen. Open it up. Here's the inside of the ship. Put Lord Vader inside. I'm going to put this back on, on the display. Just like that. And then here's the white wing from the Yellow 4 Rebel base, which is, I do really like that set, not only for the, the white wing itself, which is this thing looks really nice looking build, just the set in general at all. And then this part tells you that, hey, this is from the 1999 while you're watching this video for a lot of you people remember back then, you know, Lego system Star Wars 25 years ago, which is I'm making this video because the uh, the 25th anniversary of Lego Star Wars. And yeah, this is a nice little nostalgic. You know, the White Wing versus TIE Advance build. And now, for overall, for this Darth Vader TIE Advance custom build that I do really like this at all, more than the 2009 version. Because ever since I got this set as a kid, I started building it. And then the problem is that while I'm starting building it, the wing just falls off like that. I'm like, come on. And then 15 years later, since the TIE Bomber released it last year of 2023, that I finally get the chance to build this. This, like, hooray, this, this thing is freaking amazing. Like I said, that this thing is a hell lot better than the 2009 version. Anyways, let me know in the comments how you guys like this Darth Vader TIE Vance build. You know, ever since the TIE Bomber came out. And you get the whole point of it, what I just said during this video. Um, before the video ends, I want to say that what's your favorite TIE Fighter ship? You know, TIE Fighter, since the, the first Star Wars film came out. Like this one that we all know, which is a considered classic. Like every Star Wars content. And then... My favorite one is the TIE Interceptor from The Return of the Jedi and The Mandalorian Season 3 that not a lot of people like, which is this just looks so damn cool. Like, look at this.
my favorite TIE Interceptor. Just like Anakin Jedi Interceptor from Revenge of the Sith. Yep, that's all I have for you guys today in this video. If you like this video, give a like, hit the subscribe button, and I'm done.